Hey there, welcome. Um, my name is Kat, and today I'm going to be showing you how to play State of Grace by Taylor Swift. So this song is really, 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 really easy. Um, it's only three chords. Yeah, it's only three chords, and um, yeah, and your capo is on. It's going to be on the second fret. All right, so I'm just gonna go ahead and you know tell you what the chords are and stuff because you need to know that. Um, so the three chords you're gonna need are a D, a G, and then an E minor. Um, and for those of you who don't know how to play the chords, I'm about to show you. If you already know, you feel free to skip forward. Um, so for the D, you put your ring finger, third fret of the B string, your middle finger, second fret of the high E string, and your index finger, second fret of the G. And then you strum. And then for the G chord, you put your um, ring finger, third fret of the high E string, you put your middle finger on the third fret of the low E string, and your index finger, second fret of the A string. And then for the E minor, you put your middle finger, second fret, A string, and then your ring finger, second fret, D string, and then you strum. And that's your E minor. Okay. So, um,. For a strumming pattern, I'm really weird because I just don't use a strumming pattern, I just strum what I hear. But I'm gonna give you the simplest one I can think of for this song, which I think is down, down, up, up, down, up, down, down, up, up, down, up, down, down, up, up, down, up. I feel so dumb saying that, but <laughs> so it's like down, down, up. So that's your strumming pattern, and um, the order of the chords throughout most of the song, it's just um, a D for about like four bars, measures, I don't remember what I learned back in school, but for like, oh my god, stop texting me! Um, oh yeah, so it's just four, we're just going to say measures of each chord, so it's D. That's your majority of the whole song. Um, when it gets a little bit different is when it comes to the bridge, I guess. For the bridge, it's gonna be D, you strum once, and this is for the first time around. G, strum once, and then E minor, D, and G. And it's gonna repeat that one more time. It's gonna be D, G, E minor, D, G. So your first bridge, this is what it's going to sound like. You start strumming. Then you repeat that. Um, so yeah, that's pretty much the whole song. Um, I'm gonna play the whole thing for you guys, um, post the chords as I'm playing and you can play along with me if you want, um, but yeah, um, if you guys have any song suggestions, I will do anything if I'm familiar with the song. If not, I'll try and learn it and see what happens. Um, if you want a version with no capo, also just comment down below, subscribe, and message me, or let's talk, I don't know, just anything. Yeah, so, so now I'm going to play it with you guys, starting now.
Alright, bye. Thanks for watching.